all warfare is based on deception. For years, the West's hypocrisy has made the world a battlefield. The corrupt talk, while our brothers and sons spill their own blood. Both ways. Russian authorities claim the attack was orchestrated by an American CIA operative named Joseph Allen. The bigger the lie, the more likely people will believe it. And when a nation cries for vengeance, the lie spreads like a wildfire. I'm looking at fighter jets over at any time. The fire builds, devouring everything in its path. This is a deliberate act of war against the United States. Our enemies believe that they alone dictate the course of history. All it takes is the will of a single man. Hey, what's going on everyone? Today is November 8th and it is the release of the much anticipated Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 as many of you know. So as I'm setting up my settings here right after that short intro that I recorded for you guys, um, I'm just going to talk about the game I had just played. This is actually fresh footage. I just played my first Call of Duty uh, multiplayer match. Uh, I have played a lot of Call of Duty in the past. I played Modern Warfare 2, 10th Prestige on that. Played World of War, 10th Prestige on that. I'm just going to give a quick spoiler. It's uh, it's not anything big, so don't worry about it. Basically, on your call sign, they show your previous prestiges for specific games and what rank you were. So, for example, on my call sign, it shows that I was 10th Prestige in World of War and that I was 10th Prestige in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. It also shows my Black Ops rank, which was, I believe it was 2nd Prestige, so not that high, but still. Um, we're going to continue straight to multiplayer here. I'm not going to show you, I'm not going to commentate during the multiplayer match, but I will tell you beforehand, I used the G36C. It is the Grenadier pre-made class, and it was really fun. I did fairly well. Unfortunately, my team lost, but I was at the top of the leaderboard for my team. I believe I went 21 and 10 with three assists. I did use the noob tube a bit to test it out. I heard rumors that it wasn't nearly as powerful as it was in other games, so you don't need to worry about me getting too many kills with it. I know I did get uh, a couple of kills with it, but um, it took two noob tubes in order to kill someone, which is very good. It means you can't exactly spawn tube and search and destroy or anything like that. It's really going to put a lot of balance into the game, so if someone's using a noob tube, you won't get raped too hard. Um, so yeah, basically what happens here is I'm looking for a team deathmatch. It's taken a while to find a match, so uh, I'm just going to talk a little bit more about the game. Really smooth gameplay, the reloading's awesome. Uh, aimed out sight. The aim down sights is awesome. I'm really excited to bring you guys this video. It's a real fun gameplay. Uh, like I said, I'm not going to commentate it. I'll just let you guys see the game sound, see how everything sounds, and all that crazy awesome stuff. And then at the end of the video, uh, right after I'm done my match, I'm just going to go through the create a class because, I'm f or, well, fortunately, I hit level 4 in my first match, so I can go through the create a class, show you what guns there are, what grenades there are, and basically what options you have to edit your loadout so it's going to be fun guys hopefully you enjoy the video and if you do be sure to give it a like and favorite i'm going to be bringing you a lot more call of duty content and subscribe if you haven't already anyway guys we're about to get started so as always thanks for watching Care 
package waiting for your mark. Watcher 6, enemy UAV spotted. Care package ready for delivery. Waiting for your mark. We lost the lead. Care package ready for direction. Show us where you want it. We lost the lead. Watcher 6, enemy UAV spotted.
last UAV online.